January is winding down, which means we're getting closer to spring training. At the moment 15 of our top 50 free agents remain unsigned, including 3 of the top 7. There is a still some time to go in the offseason, for sure, but usually all the top free agents are signed by now, we're going to keep track of the day's hot stove rumblings right here in this roundup post. Make sure you check back often for updates. Dodgers, Pollock agreed a four-year deal view profile the Dodgers have signed free agent outfielder AJ. Pollock, reports Ken Rosenthal of The Athletic. According to multiple reports, the two sides agreed to a four-year deal will be in the $55 plus million range and is filled with various incentives and escalators, we've got more on the signing here. Rosenthal, January 24, 2019 The 31-year-old Pollock, who ranked no. Four on our list of top free agents this winter, authored a .257, batting line with 21 home runs and 113 games for the Arizona Diamondbacks in 2018. He's played in only 469 of 810 possible games the last five years due to various injuries. The addition of Pollock ultimately helped solidify a 2019 Dodgers outfield that will be without Yasiel Puig and Matt Kemp, who were both traded to the Cincinnati Reds in a blockbuster, seven-player trade in December. Dodgers ramp up talks with Real Muto view profile even after acquiring Russell Martin and AJ. Pollock, the Dodgers might not be done yet this offseason. The team has been in trade talks with the Miami Marlins about catcher JT. Real Muto basically throughout the winter and now it appears the team's full focus is on acquiring the all-star catcher. Bob Nightingale of USA Today reports that the Dodgers are in intensive talks with Miami for Real Muto. John Heyman of Fangard echoed the same sentiment, Dodgers are also working on JT Real Muto. They've been talking to the Marlins as the real players for the star catcher are coming into focus. John Heyman, at John Heyman, January 24, 2019 Nearly three months after Real Muto's agent Jeff Berry said his client would be wearing a different jersey to start out 2019, the Dodgers are starting to seriously emerge as Real Muto's potential landing spot for 2019. A previous report suggested top-catching prospect Hebert Ruiz was being mentioned in trade talks with the Marlins. Astros interested in bringing back Keuchel view profile The Astros still have interest in Ray signing free agent starting pitcher Dallas Keuchel, according to John Heyman of Fanker, Astros still have interest in bringing back Dallas Keuchel. So far this winter, they are down three starters, Morton, now with Rays, McCullers, Tommy John, and of course Keuchel, Jen Heyman, at John Heyman, January 24, 2019 After boasting one of MLB's best rotations last season, the Astros are down two starters with Charlie Morton signing with the Tampa Bay Rays and Lance McCullers Jr. Set to miss the entire 2019 season after undergoing Tommy John surgery. Justin Verlander and Jarrett Cole remain atop the rotation with Colin McHugh or Brad Peacock likely right behind. Josh James, Framber Valdez and top pitching prospect Forrest Whitley will be competing for the back-end spots in spring training. Kyle rejected the Astros' one-year, $17.9 million qualifying offer in November, meaning the Astros would receive a compensatory draft pick if he does sign elsewhere. Keuchel, 31, is coming off a solid season for the Astros that saw him go 12-11 with a 3.74 era, 1.31 whip and 153 strikeouts in 204.2 innings pitched. The veteran left-hander has spent his entire seven-year MLB career in Houston, and re-signing could help solidify the team's rotation for another season. Cubs sign reliever Bratch View Profile The Chicago Cubs have agreed to sign free agent relief pitcher Brad Bratch, according to the Athletics' Ken Rosenthal. The deal is a one-year contract worth $3 million, Gent Heyman of Vanguard reports. The two sides hold the mutual option for the 2020 season. Rosenthal, January 24, 2019 The 2016 All-Star had a 1.52 era in 27 appearances for the Atlanta Braves after a trade from the Baltimore Orioles in July. 
Bratch, who will turn 33 in April, has a 3.08 era in 424 career relief appearances for the San Diego Padres, Orioles and Braves, that included stretches as Dio's closer in 2017 and 18. Mariners sign reliever Strickland View profile The Seattle Mariners and Hunter Strickland agreed to a one-year contract, Ken Rosenthal of The Athletic reports. Strickland, 30, was non-tendered by the Giants this offseason, will be under control for the next three seasons through arbitration, free agent reliever, Hunter Strickland in agreement with Rosenthal, January 24, 2019 The reliever is coming off a career-worst season, highlighted by a fractured hand he suffered in June after punching a wall. Strickland has a career 2.91 era across parts of five MLB seasons, and he finished last season with 14 saves. He'll most likely be the leading candidate for the closer job in Seattle.